Shadow Joe's. We're mad that we're not going to be able to breed tegus anymore. And somebody's going to pay for it. Florida Wildlife Commission, this is what we think about you. <laughs> we hope you're happy. You made a baby sad. Uh, what? Make you sad too? Yeah, it made me sad. Make Eric sad? I'm sad. Make you sad, Cam? No? You don't care? <laughs> hold on. You're putting your finger over it. No! Would you stop like it's that? You gotta hold it the whole time like that. So me and Eric are gonna collect some eggs. We've got the box. We haven't checked it yet. So this is a, uh, this is all, what is it, live? Don't laugh, me. Here you, Mr. Eric. Let's see what she is and what she looks like. Show, look down there, show, look down there. Woo, daddy. It looks like she's still laying eggs, but we're gonna pull them anyway. All right, Mr. Eric, grab that femur before she starts eating eggies. Before she starts having eggs for dinner. Kimmy, you're pointing it towards the ground. Well, come on, we're filming. Honey, you're supposed to film this stuff. No, I want you to see the ground. With your toes. Eric, will you grab that lizard, please? I don't want to bite me. Just it's okay if she bites you, it don't hurt. Yeah, a little bit. Eric, she's dancing on the edge. Bro, you gotta you want me to do it? <laughs> Come on, get out of there. No, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. There we go. So, right. if you guys look at that female, that is the classic Argentine black and white tegu. First of all, you can see how empty she is. But she has a big fractured or shattered pattern, they call that. She has marbling on her head. Looks like she's been eating an egg or something like that because her mouth is all gooey. She's all emptied out. Her tail's all skinny. That's very indicative of a um, of an animal that just laid her eggs. Plus, the good thing is she still has some energy left. So being a little nippy and bitey is good. That means she didn't completely drain herself. Let's cover her up and collect the eggs. What, well, baby? Yes. They obviously want to do it because they're telling me that. Okay. Eric will help you though. So Cammy Joy and Kiki are getting in there. Watch out. They've been doing this their whole lives. Really? Uh, really? You don't know that? No. Please don't turn them eggs all over in different places. Can we move this here? So here it is, uh, late April. And usually this time of the year, we've already got a bunch of clutches, but it's really late this year. But it's kind of good that it's late because the longer the females hold their eggs, a little hint for you tegu breeders out there, the longer they hold the eggs, the more swole, the more swole the eggs get, the better. Look at this little, and look how they're all different shapes and sizes. And yet these are perfect eggs, nice and That's fluffy. We're about to walk the rest of the line because we still got about 20 females. Look at my chickens, guys. Give you a little tour while they're collecting eggs. I'm just a boy from New York City. A city boy from New York City. And look at this. I got chickens. These are my silky chickens. They're one of the smallest kinds of chickens. I got black ones, white ones, and red ones. And then I got Brahma chickens, which is the biggest chicken in the world. Look at the size of these chickens, guys. This is crazy. Look at this. Look at my Brahma chickens. Look at the size of this thing. Look at that. Oh man, their feeder is blocked up. No wonder they're upset. I shake it free. Get that food flowing again. Yeah. Some water.
You're welcome. Look at this. I got doves. Just like the white winged dove. See my doves? That's a girl. She's got eggs in her egg box. That's a daddy and two babies. I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> oh, my kids think who they are. They got some confidence. Girl, you think you're too old to get a whooping? You're going to find out the hard way you ain't. Uh oh. We got some chicken love happening over there. Yeah, that's called chicken love. And there's the girls' bunny rabbits. They got these. What a life. My goodness, am I blessed. I got a tegu farm. <sighs> How are we looking, guys? Let's see. Did it? Bye, Carrie. Don't. 42? Yeah. This one's mushy, so this one ain't no good. We're going to throw this one out when we get upstairs. Is so 41 in that one? Good one? Bad one? A yeah, tiny little booger. Yeah, it's a bunch of those. Like this one. All right. Come on out, Cam Jam. All right, so let's see if she's got any more in there. We got the stick out, we got the box down. Let's put her back, open that up. There she is, mad as all get. Oh, mm. grab that egg, she laid another one. She was in the middle of laying. Eric is afraid of her. Yep, yeah, she's still got a few more left in there. Let's see that one, is that good? Yeah, it feels nice. Yep. Sometimes that happens, but you got to sacrifice those ladder eggs because. <sighs> Dang, she probably got two more. 43. Yeah, she got a bunch. Uh, well, I don't know about a bunch, Including but she got a few left in there. Your chick one. So we'll come back out tonight and see if she has a oh, few yeah. more. There are 43. What's matter? But 42 good ones, one bad one. Yeah, she's not uh, tired. No, no. So let's, let's check the rest of the line and show everybody how we do this. So we walk down, if you guys see, we have each cage has got a little stick on it, Whoop. seeing what's in it. And then we got the flags that tell us the animals that are ready to lay eggs. Where you going? All right, so what happens is we come out at night and we check them. We open the cage, Eric loose up the box. Say, nope, nothing. We gotta do this three, four, five times a day sometimes. Put the locks back on. In this case, the lock is just a nail. See another one right there, sleeping. Nice nest though. Ready to lay your eggs. Next one. Oh yeah, she's getting a nice nest build out there. Nothing yet though. Right now all we're checking is the black and whites. The next one that's gonna start laying eggs are the, uh... what's over here? She laid. Oh, how come we ain't got a stick on her? Yeah, she must have, she must have fell off. Sleeping, nothing in there, so no eggs. The next one's gonna start laying eggs are the uh, the ice tegus. So we should be getting ice female uh, ice eggs any day now. Piglet. No, I don't even waste trying to chicken pig. She's a big fat nothing. Do nothing biscuit that she is. 
A do nothing biscuit female. Anybody want a good female tape? Oh, look at that nice nest. You guys see how, I don't know if you can see that because of the depth, but she's got a big old circle up under there. She's tied up under there. Yeah, and then they just, one day they just stopped laying them in that egg. Okay. Wasn't me. <laughs> yep, yeah, another beautiful nest, man. Now look how tall. I think you guys can see how tall that nest is. Man. Everybody's making big old nests now. The hotter it gets, I guess the cooler they want to be. All right, well, that's how we do it. I'm going to end this video here. What do you say? What did I say? You're a nasty shirt. He always wears them nasty shirts. I didn't... Oh, he was reading my shirt. Man, look at that. Oh, man. Can you see that? What is that? You got blood from that stupid mosquito that's bit me. That's a baby. All right, guys. Until next time. Oh, Oh,